Our final stop is the FedEx Orange Bowl. Big Ten runner-up Iowa is bound for Miami. For the second time in school history, Iowa has landed in a BCS Bowl game. Flying high for the first nine weeks, the Hawkeyes were off to their best start in school history. They'll look to finish the season with their best record since 2002. And that sea of yellow will run into a bunch of yellow jackets. Georgia Tech has won 11 games in a season for the first time since its national championship run in 1990. So far this season, Georgia Tech has left opposing defenses in a rambling wreck. The Yellow Jackets hope to sting their opponents with their rushing attack. The ACC champs are coming to the Orange Bowl for the first time since 1967. Let's start the clock right now. Keep it running the whole game, because that's what Georgia Tech does, Jimmy. Yeah, but Georgia Tech runs a little bit different style of offense from everybody else in the country. They run an option offense, and they score a lot of points. But I think with Iowa having a long time to prepare for this ball game, they'll be able to slow them down, be a defensive ball game on both sides. And you hear a lot of complaints about Iowa throughout the year, but there are worse things you could say about a team than opportunistic, resourceful, and resilient. I mean, Kirk Ferentz finally has his guys back. He has true Hawkeyes playing for Iowa again. They're back in the Orange Bowl. You remember last time? We saw them play in the Orange Bowl against USC. A big year for them. Bring a lot of fans down to the Orange Bowl. Uh, Doesn't hurt one bit. They, they, they've got to give a big assist to their fans for being in the Orange Bowl because the way the Hawkeyes travel, that doesn't hurt one bit. Hey, one quick note on Georgia Tech. Got to get it going because the ACC just won and eight in BCS Bowl games this decade. The Bull Bash returns. January 2010 on Fox.